Hey everyone, Christy here. I have been away from YouTube for a while, a couple days now, because of this. This is Ashi. <laughs> and I'm dog sitting. Uh, an emergency dog sitting came up, and so uh, for a colleague, I am spending the time at their apartment with Eshi to keep her company. Uh, but while I am here, uh, I will just say that <laughs> It's hard to be serious and angry when there's a dog who wants to be pet by you. Um, right, so what is happening is... Focus, Christy, focus. Right. Let's start at the end. Armored Skeptic made a video with my picture in the thumbnail and a title that read, SJWs are trying to deplatform me. And honestly, I don't even care what's in the video because just from the get-go, that title with my image is a lie. Greg is lying to you, and I'm going to explain why. A few days ago, weeks ago, I, no, not weeks ago, a few days ago, I learned that Carl Benjamin was coming to Milwaukee, Wisconsin to give a, a talk, uh, do an interview thingy uh, for Mythicist Milwaukee. I am a Wisconsin native. It's my home state. And when I learned that people were going to fly to bring that bigot hate monger, liar, promoter of the alt-right, harasser of women to my home state, there was just no way I was going to not tell people that he is terrible, he's awful, he's bigoted. He, the kind of hate that he spews on his YouTube channel is something I don't want to see spread in my home state. I don't want to see, I, I want people to know the kind of garbage that he spews. So I contacted local politicians, I contacted the uh, people hosting the event to say that you are bringing someone who has been endorsed by the fascist EDL to your to this event. You are bringing someone who admitted to organizing an online harassment campaign of a member of parliament that was rape themed. You are bringing someone who is willing to laugh at the murder of a woman for political reasons. Uh, and yes, Carl did laugh at Heather's murder. And I think all these things should be known. If people are going to be seeing Carl as a as a messenger of, of YouTube um, skepticism, well then I want to, people to know that there are other people who disavow any kind of association and disavow the kind of vile hatred and bigotry and misinformation and poor scholarship and just garbage that gets spewed out of his mouth. So that's what I've been doing. I've been doing two things precisely. I have been um, providing people with Carl's own tweets his own words and his own video clips in his own words. And I've been my expressing my um, opinion to ask Mythicist Milwaukee if, if these kinds of bigoted statements, if these kinds of hateful things are representative uh, or what they want to give a platform to, if, that, if that's what they want to promote, if that's who they are. And that is what my focus has been. It's been on raising attention and concern about the kind of bigotry and misogyny and ignorance that Carl promotes. So I was really surprised when I was lumped in with other people calling, being called an SJW trying to deplatform Armored Skeptic. And so I'm just going to call Greg right now. You're being a propagandist. You're being a liar. And the whole point of other people raising concerns about your appearance at this conference is that they don't think you're a very good skeptic. And I think if you watch videos by Dr. Lehman, then you'll see exactly why people don't think you're a very good skeptic, because you don't actually practice skepticism and you don't do proper research. And I was, you know, I didn't tweet about you. I didn't raise June and Greg, she went ahead, an armored skeptic at all in any of my communications, any of my tweets, anyone I've talked to. And Greg, if you can find any of those, I'll give you $50 because they don't exist. I am very confident because I know, honestly, I don't give a crap about you. I don't give a crap about your appearance. I don't, you're just not that important in the light of a guy who laughed at the murder of my friend for two hours, who called feminists the ones to blame for the murders committed by Elliot Roger, for a man who is, was, you know, called Richard Spencer our guy. You know, so, but now you've done this and you've pissed me off. So, you know, if you don't issue a retraction and a correction and an apology for your misinformation that you've been spreading on your channel, then I'm going to have to add you to the list. I'm going to have to add you to the people I'm complaining about, and I'm going to cite your basic lack of scholarship. It's just even reading Twitter. It's on my Twitter. Just go through my Twitter. You could see all of my communications there. They're public. 
And you can see that I just never care that much about your appearance. So yeah, this one's for you, Greg. Take down your video, take down your thumbnail, change your title, remove any mention of me because I had nothing to do with this. And now if you see this, and I will tag you into this on Twitter, if you see this and you don't take it down, you're just demonstrating everybody's point that you're not a good skeptic and that you are, basically the reactions you're getting are people who object to you being held up as a representative of YouTube skepticism because we're all embarrassed by the idea of you being held up as the kind of skepticism that is currently practiced on YouTube, especially by atheists. It's a big problem. Your reputation does not help us. Your methods make us look bad. And now your propagandist tactics here, they're just embarrassing. All right, so I've got all day to do cuddles with the goose with Eshi. So the two of us are gonna hang out here. This is how you get her attention. Stop petting her, all right? You give her a few seconds and then she'll She'll be all over me. All right, guys, I'm going to go spend time with playing with the dog. Uh, I've been Christy. I told you. You've been awesome. Ashley's been awesome. And we will both, well, no, just me. I'll see you again very soon. Okay, okay. Bye. Say bye. Bye.